We're often asked what it looks like on a low-tech mushroom farm, and in this video I want to show you. Hey guys and welcome to our farm. You can see here the farm behind me, it's a quite small compact space and that's basically where we do most of the work. We've got a small pasteurization area, there's a mixing space further back and then there's an incubation space behind me too. Over there we've got a separate workshop where we've got a small fruiting tent and there's some storage space. So I want to take you for a closer look now. Let's go. This here is our mixing room. We've got a compost tumbler in there. It's a really simple process. So we take all of our main ingredients. That's spawn, obviously. We mix it in with straw, but also other ingredients like sawdust pellets and coffee. And we mix it so we create the ideal parameters for the mushrooms to thrive. We put it in bags and we cap it really tightly. And that's the moment where we take it away and put it into the incubation. So once the bags are hung up in the incubation room, the first stage of the growing process starts. It's where the mycelium will colonize the mix that we've given it to grow on. What you can see here is a whole wall of these bags and at the moment it's summer. So what we've got colonizing here is summer oyster. We've got some pink oyster, some yellow oyster and also some Italian oyster. It's a very visual process. This bag here is about one week old. You can see the layers are joining up takes about two to three weeks for the bag to be fully colonized and that's when we'll hang them in the fruiting room. Once the bags make it in here to the fruiting room, they're already primed and ready to start growing. All we need to do is provide them with the autumn-like conditions to start them off. So we provide them with a little bit of light, we have humidity and plenty of fresh air exchange in here, creating that damp autumn-like environment and the mushrooms respond to that and begin to start growing out the bags, some small pins at first, they grow really fast. Within about a week to 10 days, they're ready to harvest. And so we simply just twist them off the columns into our trays. And we usually harvest once a week like this and the mushrooms are then ready to go to the restaurant. But that's not all we do. We're constantly experimenting, trying to find low tech ways to grow other mushroom varieties both inside and outside, like we have here in the mushroom garden, where we're growing medicinal mushrooms on logs and in mushroom beds. So that's it, we had a good look around everything we do here. Thanks a lot for joining us for the tour, we'll see you soon.